So in this video, we are going to take a close look at this retro Super Jolt Gun Real Arcade Experience. Double the light gun, let's double the fun. So let's go! Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's awesome that you're tuning in. So in this video, we are going to get a blast to the past. Because we're going to take a close look at the Super Jolt Gun. And it is compatible with PlayStation. Recently, with an unboxing, I showed you a game that I wanted to play for a very long time. And never owned it as a kid. And I wanted to try it out with the new light guns I picked up recently. These were brand new unboxed. And I just wanted to check it out here on the channel. So let's start with the unboxing. Which colors did I get? And let's have some old school fun with the PlayStation and yep, with a CRT. So the light gun has been made by Innovation. I can remember they made a lot of, let's say, pieces of hardware for your PlayStation 1 and maybe also for PlayStation 2. Here you can see like it has different colors over here with the gray, the yellow, the red, the blue, the black and I think it's the white edition. So there are quite interesting versions out there. I think there are even more editions out there. What I understand of that, there are like generations of these light guns. So this is more like the latest batch of the last batch they released and therefore different colors. Okay, so let's do a quick unboxing. The box itself is not really special. They're not advertising about some certain game that it is compatible with. I already removed some plastics. It comes with the telephone cable that is going to be connected with the pedal. Pretty cool, the pedal, I like it for reloading with some games like Time Crisis. This is the grey version. Personally, I like this color. Oh, I really like it. So we'll give you a quick overview of the light gun later on when I connected it. Otherwise, it's pretty pointless to show you. And we're going to get also here a retro big with this one. So we're going to hook it up. I'm going to show you how you need to connect it. And uh, let's have some fun. Recently, I picked up this game from Magic Button. And yeah, I picked it up myself and I paid for it. Okay, so what I do like about this game are the mini games. I will show a couple of them. It's so much fun playing this. I played this game so much with the demo and actually never got the full edition. So for me, I like Memory Lane and finally playing the game that I wanted to play for so long. I don't know what happened with the manual itself, but there is a manual, so that's the most important thing. The discard itself of Point Blank. <laughs> with the two happy do faces. I played the game actually like in the arcades. Maybe we're going to look up in the future the full size arcade machine just to see how it is. Okay, here having the original G-Con, the light gun. I never did a review about it, so maybe it's fun to check it out with some games in the future, just how it is compared with the light gun with the recall. Okay guys, so let's grab my PlayStation, let's have some fun and let's play some point blank today with the real arcade or semi relocate light guns. Okay guys, so for this part, let's connect everything. So we need to do like the first connector needs to go into the controller port. Okay, so let's do that for controller number one and number two, because this game has the option to play together with your buddy. So this video is just going to play by myself. Okay, so let's connect this one. This is going to be like in cable nightmare. We need to plug all these bloody things over here in the AV out. Well, by the way, different adapters. So this is one of the ways because, yeah, this is just one of the first generation PlayStation. It has this option. So we're just going to use this tower like this. Okay, so let's enter the point blank game and let's have some fun. All right, guys. So we need to switch between the original one and this recall version. Sadly, even with the G-Con setting on the light controller or light gun, it is not possible to use this one in the game. Maybe with maybe Point Blank 2 we have the capability, but for now, we're going to do it something differently. We're not going to use it because this thing works for shit. So we're going to switch to the original Nemco light gun. That was very convenient, just pick one up from Magic Button. So we're going to check it out and we're going to play the game like this. No dual light gun recall function. Okay guys, so let's play a little bit of Point Blank. I've played this game so much on with the demo, so let's see what we're going to get today. And it is going to be a blast.
Alright, so next up, let's see how many of these freaking fish we can shoot. Okay, so I really love playing these games. They're very fast, very quick, but sometimes quite difficult. They need to be having a little bit of a name. For the last one, let's see. Okay, shoot the sample. Oh man, this is going to be quite a challenge. Okay guys, so I was a little bit bummed out that we couldn't play the point blank game with my arcade light gun. Yep, I tried a couple of them and the same result over and over again. So that's the reason I needed to pick the original Nemco one. Maybe in some other video games we can use them. I did a full review how to hook it up, how everything works with my previous video in combination with Time Crisis. And with Time Crisis it did work very well and I can say I had a splendid time making that video. So if you want to see more action of this version on my PlayStation 1, first edition you can always check out my previous video where i did play a little bit of a time crisis together with you guys a very challenging game and even before i was recording this video i played it for some time to get a little bit in the light gun mode again but again it's, it's so cool to play the game on my crt okay guys so i hope you really enjoyed this video i had a blast making it recording it for you guys let me know in the comments did you ever play point blank and what is your experience with your first light gun was it from the nes or did you just start it with the playstation or sega saturn if you like it i can make more videos about it there are so many different light guns out there there are so many great games we can play i want to thank you for watching consider subscribing hit the little bell become one of the wicked family and i will see you in the next video Thank you.